I'm not actually scheduled to work today. I work four tens instead of like a five day a week schedule. On one of the off days, I'll sign on just to go over labs. So then that way I can like cut back on the hours on my Fridays. Oh my gosh, what's my password? Oh gosh. Seriously, I go to California for a few days and then I forget my password, but I got it. A lot of messages, tons of labs. I'm gonna be here for a minute. I worked a lot longer than I anticipated working today. On the bright side, that means that on Friday, I get to work three hours less. That's pretty great. Because the work took so much longer, I have not gone around to plant care yet. Also, I needed to empty this container. My other container that I was using for plants was getting really disgusting. I reused it for over a year, so it was time to get a new one. I finally finished plant care. It is now 5 p.m. In the clips following this one, you are gonna see that my lips look insane because they are gonna be very swollen because I'm gonna inject my own lips. So I am a nurse practitioner and I am trained in aesthetics as well. So I don't recommend for anyone to inject their own lips if you're not trained for it. When you see me in the next clip, it's not the final result. It takes two weeks for it to settle. So my lips are going to look bigger than what I intend for them to look like. So I'll be back. My lips were huge. This is not the final result and it's gonna go down um, in swelling significantly. I also swell and bruise a ton because for me on a client, it's a lot easier. And then for me on in the mirror, it's a really weird angle. So then I kind of pause. When I am doing a client, it is a lot more swift in movements. So yeah, I'm happy with the result, but I definitely need the swelling to go down. I will show you what the actual result looks like. Uh, you'll see when I start recording in later days. Yes, ignore the crazy lips for the rest of the video. It's my little sunbathing hour. He started over there and then he moved there. And now he's here. He's like turning like a rotisserie chicken. He's done. My bruising is no joke. Okay. Well, just ignore that. When I went to visit my friend in California recently, she had the cutest of her mitts. I have been looking for a neutral one and I just need another pair just because I've had one since college. That's a long time. Yeah, so I've had just one from undergrad that I've always used, but you know when you have like more people at your house and you all are trying to cook, like more than one person needs oven mitts at one time anyways? With trying to be minimalist, there's always like this fine line of too little and then too much. I think two pairs should be good. It has, it's like grippy, which is great because I am a little bit accident prone. The color is just like this perfect, like taupey, light tan color. See? <laughs> Yeah, very exciting. I'm waiting for somebody else to come so I can actually make my dry shampoo and I'm gonna show the process of that and see how well that works because I've been wanting to make that for a while. Yeah, I'll show it in a sec. This is what they're up to. Oh, did I interrupt you? Sorry, boo-boos. I'm gonna make some dry shampoo. I saw this really quick recipe on Instagram when I was just scrolling through reels and it was such a quick recipe that I didn't save anything so I don't actually know what the creator name is. I didn't make up this recipe. This is just arrowroot powder. I have dried rose here. These are compostable tea bags. So once I'm done with it, I'm just gonna compost this and then I have this little bottle. It's for powder. So it pumps out powder because it's gonna be a dry shampoo. I'm just gonna open this up. Oh gosh. I'm already making a mess and I barely started. Got a small spoon, so that should work out. Oh my gosh, why am I like this? Okay, there you go. Just gonna put a good amount in here. That looks good. I get one of these compostable tea bags. If you hear background noise, my dogs are um, playing again. They do that like 20 times a day, just play wrestling. All of those thick Milo's entire foot in her mouth and like yank on it for fun but no one's yelping so i feel like it's fine this smells so good just gonna throw some in here the having this bag is just helpful so i'll have the scent of rose but it's not gonna you know when i 
um, spray it in my hair, the rose petals aren't gonna come out. So for me to look like I just came out of a jungle or something. Stick that tea bag in here. The longer it sits in here, the more scent there's actually gonna be. In case this gets really messy, I'm gonna use this in the bathroom because it's just easier to clean these floors. Let's see. I wash my hair every other day and I don't ever go longer than that, but I feel like definitely by like, hair wash day, it's already pretty greasy. So it's nice to be able to use dry shampoo before I have to wash my hair. So I wash my hair at night. I'm gonna wash my hair tonight anyways, and it's like almost time for me to wash my hair, but I just wanted to try this in case it made my hair really weird and it just wasn't gonna work out, but I like this stuff. I'm not gonna have to buy dry shampoo anymore. And like that took me two seconds to make. I can't get over the lips. <laughs> I definitely saw patients like this today, but it's okay because I actually had a lip gloss on earlier that's like the same color as my actual lip. So it, it was helpful, it wasn't as bad. It wasn't great, but it wasn't as bad. I am gonna walk on the treadmill for the next 30 minutes just in my office. This is two days after injections. I don't wear lip gloss often. This is actually like a lip oil and I, I really like it. I'm just often lazy to put it on. This is like the same color as my natural lip and it's called like Au Naturel by Merit. Looks better, right? It's not as intense. Um, you can know if I still see the bruising, but honestly, I just need it to look better on camera because I am seeing patients on camera. Anyways, ooh, my outfit. This is from Elwood Clothing, not sponsored, I wish. Like I had never heard of it before my husband started buying from them, but they have like organic cotton clothing, which is usually very expensive. Like these are more affordable and it's also made it with I'm not seeing any patients yet, um, not until a little bit later in the day. Usually I have like back to back in the mornings, but not today. I am just gonna review some labs and stuff. And then uh, when I do see patients, I like cut my, it's like to my neck and then my hair is down. So you can't actually see what I'm wearing anyways, because I never wanna look unprofessional, but I also wanna be very comfy since you're not gonna see what I wear anyway. So what's the point of dressing up, right? Why must you log me out? I literally just signed in. I have an appointment soon and let me uh, just touch this back up. So I was just FaceTiming with my baby niece and she's a toddler and she doesn't form like full sentences, but she kept pointing at the camera and then pointing at her own lips because my lips look like this. <laughs> She's like, what is wrong with your lips? I am still on my apple kick. Oh, by the way, this fruit bowl, this huge fruit bowl, it's handmade. I got this from Facebook Marketplace and usually something of this size would be so expensive, but I got it for $15. It's not a great deal. I love the colors, you know, cause it's like tan and brown. <laughs> can fit so much fruit in there, even though I have two apples in there now, cause I've been eating apples every day. Are you slobbering all over the place? Olive just drank a bunch of water and she has such a flappy face, slobbers everywhere. Milo doesn't get water everywhere after he drinks like she does because her little flaps come down so far. And I have water puddles all over the floor. It's okay, it'll work it. My compost day, because it's normally at the end of the month, but I actually can schedule it, so it's actually gonna be tomorrow. That's really close to the last time that they picked up. But the reason why I have to do that is because we're going to Japan and Obviously, if we're not here, I'm gonna have zero compost. I just said that I switched the composting day till, till tomorrow, and I just got a text that it's actually today because I thought today was Tuesday for some reason. It's Wednesday. I need to drop this off in the front. So they're gonna come by and pick it up later tonight, but I don't wanna forget, especially if I get busy with work or something. So 
Let me go do this right now. Yeah, there's not too much in here. This is what I wear to inject patients. I'm also gonna put up my hair so my hair doesn't get in the way. I hate when my front pieces aren't pulled out. Mm, good enough. I am ready and I'm not filming any of it because I don't think I should. So I'll be back. She would let me show it. <laughs> Honey, <laughs> let me. Okay, the flaps are in the way. You can see it says olive, and then there's a tiny little olive on it. I got it from Etsy. Oh, pretty girl. I am gonna end the vlog here. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.